Evening, lovely people. It's um, Wednesday the 15th, something like half past three just after. Long tail tits on the move above my head. Um, I'm going down for like my fourth or fifth attempt at bitten. Uh, white swan, of course. And um, it's really still, it's not raining, it really is ideal conditions. Uh, just had a chiff jeff, I don't know if I've been able to pick up any call with the few second footage I've just recorded. Um, just had a kingfisher as well, and um, most stuff I'm just sort of clocking for, well, you know, still around for the new year. Get the 2022 list kicked off to... Um, whatever level I can. Uh, I don't know, too early to say what um, circumstances, weather, etc. is going to be like, uh, but uh, track record is generally between 64 and 69 species. My record is 72 on the first. Absolutely means nothing at all unless a bonus rarity turns up. That's happened too in past years, And um, but on the whole, it's about being thorough and um, comprehensive if you're so inclined like I am and um, perhaps I'll talk more about that in another video but uh, I'll check in with you in a minute when I get to White Swan see what the score is and uh, finally there is success a uh, tiny bit left of center there is a bird back on slightly facing right and I will have to zoom it up slightly just to prove my point. Uh, you might have just seen that little movement left where it dropped its head left. It's, let me zoom this up. You can see the darker back of the head. There is a slight breeze. It doesn't make it imperfect <laughs> it's, it's got its head up again mind the um, untrained observer for bittens they hunt on the water's edge at this time of day they are up high in the reeds uh, some form of favorite place to hunker down as it gets nearer dusk it's just about make out now there's a paler mark just underneath the darker feathers of the back side of the head. I'm not going to zoom it up any more at this point because it's just going to become too pixelated as the light uh, fades out. Just, uh, it's quite a pale faced bird. He's going to move around more. Yeah, it is. Look. I've seen him like this many, many times, and um, it's probably 50 50. Oh, here we go. Come on. Well, there you have it, uh, success. I uh, was not at all surprised. Conditions and sheer persistence always pays when it comes to bittens. Um, you've got to come at dusk or before. It's only like four-ish now. Um, and you've got to be prepared to come several times to um, up your odds. This is what they do. They sit high in the reeds. And if you're lucky, you see one jump up. And uh, sometimes only move two or three meters. Sometimes they fly 
you know, over the more or less the entire reed bed. That one obviously went back, couldn't stay on it with the uh, digiscoping, but nonetheless, um, it's my first bitten this winter. Very, very slack of me. <laughs> <laughs>